Hey guys, welcome to Cora Radar, your one-stop shop for tips and tricks in the digital world. Today we'll talk about what to do when your iPhone won't enter standby mode. iPhones are no longer just devices that get us to contact the people we miss. They are a lot like multifunctional machines. Thanks to the standby mode released in the iOS 17 update, iPhone now can be used as a high-definition display showing clock, date and time, notifications, live activities and more. It's good until you find iPhone standby mode not working. Though, you can still venture into this new feature by following us to figure out the causes and try some troubleshooting steps. Why won't your iPhone go into standby mode? Here are 5 reasons. Your iPhone doesn't support standby mode. The feature is in off status. The iPhone isn't charging and locked. Standby mode turns itself off, making it seem like standby mode not working on iPhone. Software bugs occur on the device. Thankfully, you can get your device booting and running again on your own. So here's what you need to do when standby mode isn't working on iPhone. Don't worry if you're a novice of digital devices or a new iPhone user. We'll introduce all the methods step by step. Besides, if you have any questions, write it down in the comment below and we'll reply to you within 24 hours. Verify if standby mode is available on your iPhone. As mentioned above, standby mode is a function coming with the iOS 17 update. That is to say, your iPhone won't go into standby mode if it's not compatible with iOS 17 or it's not updated to iOS 17 or later. For your information, iPhone models that support iOS 17 as well as the standby feature cover iPhone SE 2nd Gen or later, iPhone XR, iPhone XS, iPhone XS Max, iPhone 11 Series, iPhone 12 Series, iPhone 13 Series, iPhone 14 Series, iPhone 15 Series or newer models. If your device is on the list but standby mode is still not working on your iPhone, then move to the troubleshooting steps below. Make sure standby mode is on. Generally, standby mode is in on status after you install the iOS 17 software on your iPhone. Though, chances are that it's toggled off sometimes, which leads to standby mode not working on iPhone. So, it's advised to check if you've turned on standby mode. Here are the steps. Go to the Settings app. Scroll down to find and select standby. Move the toggle of standby to green on status if it's off. If it's on, disable it first. A few seconds later, enable it. To test it, charge your phone and lock the screen. If you see the current date and time, live activities or cool widgets, it means that the iPhone standby mode works again. Meet the requirements to use standby mode. Have confirmed that your iPhone supports standby mode and the feature is on? Great, there are still three requirements to put the iPhone into standby mode. 1. The iPhone is charging. Both charging with cable or MagSafe is fine. 2. The iPhone screen is locked. 3. The iPhone in landscape orientation at an inclined angle. As long as you satisfy the needs, you should see the iPhone go into standby mode automatically. Take a look at the charging cable, charger and power source. Your iPhone won't enter standby mode while charging? Time to inspect if the charging process goes well. First of all, check if the lightning cable works well and is certified by Apple. Second, see if the charger is in working condition and is certified by Apple. Third, test if the power source delivers power to charge an iPhone. Fourth, clean the charging port to make sure there is no dust or dirt preventing it from charging. If any of them goes wrong, standby mode won't work on your iPhone because of no charging. Why is standby mode not always on? You manage to enter standby mode on iPhone. However, it turns off on its own automatically, making it seem like it's not working at all. To be honest, it's normal in an iPhone with no never turn display off option in standby feature. For that, the display will be switched off when the iPhone isn't in use. For your information, the never turn display off option is now only available in iPhone 14 Pro, iPhone 14 Pro Max, iPhone 15 Pro, and iPhone 15 Pro Max. If you're using one of these models and want to keep iPhone standby mode working all the time while charging, do the following steps. Go to the Settings app. Find and choose Standby. Tap Display and choose Never Under the Turn Display Off. Restart your iPhone. This step aims to remove the software bugs to fix iOS 17 standby mode not working. They could crop out for no reason, and doing a reboot is enough to solve them. For different iPhone models, the way to do a power cycle is different if you're using an iPhone 10, 11, or later iPhone models. Do this to restart your iPhone. Press and hold the volume up or down button and the side button until the power off slider appears. Drag the slider to the right and wait 30 seconds for your device to turn off. To turn your device back on, 
Press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. If you're using an iPhone 8 or older iPhone models, do this to restart your iPhone. Press and hold the side button until the power off slider appears. Drag the slider to the right and wait 30 seconds for your device to turn off. To turn your device back on, press and hold the side button until you see the Apple logo. Now, go to Settings app and make sure Standby mode is enabled. Then, plug your iPhone into a charger and lock it. See if Standby mode works on iPhone properly this time. And there you have it, folks. Hope the solutions in this video help Standby work again on your iPhone properly. Thank you for watching, and we wish you the best of luck in getting your iPhone back in working condition. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel for more tech-related content. Until next time.